brothers and sisters of the celestial energy, brother wisdom. Just want to share this with you. Um, so I talked to my mom this morning, and um, she's the grand mantra. One of the wisest women you ever want to know is my mom. Um, she's in tune to nature. This is one thing that, one uh, area, you know, that that was passed down to me is her being in tune to nature. My dad was as well, you know, even though he's passed on to the next life, but that was 20 years ago. Uh, I still miss that guy. Um, that was 20 years ago. Um, he was in tune to nature as well. Um, my mom says since uh, Monday, the last six days since Monday, from about six in the morning, six six thirty in the morning to about two o'clock, she had been hearing like a rumbling sound, and she said it sounded like. Um, you know how when you, when you um, see those trucks, those big trucks at the at the truck stop, and they're they're just you know in the in the in the rest mode, the trucks are just parked or whatever. But that little, she said, that's what it sounded like, and she said she realized that it was coming from underground. Um. Even though, you know, because she's in South Carolina, even though South Carolina has has earthquakes, but she says she's been hearing it, and she's been asking my pops, you know. Um, she asked pops that uh, he hear it, and he said he didn't hear it. Um, she said she would, be, she would ask a couple other people. They didn't hear it. And I told her, you know, I was like, this is nature. I said, nature is coming out of that deep sleep that she was once in. And nature is now, you know, she's sitting up now. At one point she was on her back, but she was deep in the sleep because when these beings came and caused us to fall into that deep sleep, when we fell asleep, nature fell asleep because we are the atoms of nature. We have awakened the brothers and sisters and now we need that grand awakening. That's why we started talking about building structures and designs because that opens up our um, gateways awakening even deeper. So she said that um, she said that she looked around the house. She thought there was someone who was um, um, she thought it was a truck in front of the house. She thought it was doing some work or whatever in front of the house. So she looked outside, there was no one. She said she thought they were working in the school, um, in, in, at the school behind her. And she looked in the backyard where, where they were, and there was nobody working in the school. She looked up in the air, made sure there were no helicopters or nothing flying around. And she says she's been hearing this, gro this groaning, this rumbling, from six from about six to two so that's like is that eight hours six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve one two that is eight hours so for eight hours she's been hearing these rumblings and um these these like you know a, a, a truck these, these big trucks you know because i told her i said well it sound like a, a a caterpillar like an earth mover or something she, and she says, no, it just sounds like one of those trucks that's, you know, that it, it would be a tractor. It would be a tractor, more so like a tractor sound. And she's been hearing that every morning, every day for last six days, eight hours. And then she said after two o'clock, it was stop. Nature is getting ready to stand up. She's already sitting up. You can't put us back to sleep. That's number one. You try putting us back to sleep with all your, uh, with the little thing that you had going on back in 2020, 2021. You know, you try putting us to sleep then. 
we didn't fall asleep. We actually became more awakened. Now it's time for us to become more aware of everything that's going on around us because we are getting ready to see a whole new world, a whole new realm, all right? I told my mom to watch out for two days. I told I took two different two different dates. I told her to watch out for August the 25th, and I told her to watch for December 22nd. All right, but she's been hearing these for the last six days. I told her about Gina Marie Coven Hill, how she has been doing her videos about her hearing these deep frequencies, these frequencies, and she's, you know how G. Marie Coven Hill was talking about how these frequencies are like weakening her body, which, you know, naturally it's going to do that to those, to these inorganic beings anyway. It's going to weaken their bodies. But just know, brothers, that's why this is it's important for us to be in this point of time in our lives for this awakening period, for this awakening moment, for us to tap into that infinite space of power and energy. These inorganic beings are working so hard to try to make our planet cool. They're working hard to make our planet cool. This is not their home. All you Inorganics, all you beings who don't look like this right here, this is not your home. I don't care where the fuck you go, but you got to get the fuck off this planet. You got to get the fuck off this planet. You got to get the fuck off this planet. You got to get the fuck off this planet. You can go where the fuck you want to go, but you got to leave here. That's number one. I don't care how much friends and all this other bullshit. Yeah, you got to get the fuck off. That's number one. Your systems that you created, everything that you did. The forefathers came and the decimation that they did, wiping out whole territories, wiping out whole bloodlines, whole generations. So that you can have free reign in a place where you're not supposed to be. Humans, human civilizations on an alien planet. They're still trying to figure us out. They're still trying to figure our planet out. They never will. Some things that are secret must remain secret. And if the secret comes out, it's going to show itself in the form of nature. Time for them to go. Just want to share that with y'all guys. Um, share in the comments if you've been hearing any of these... these uh, frequencies and energies all right it's important catch you guys later you know the deal all power to the motor shock unless you're angelic beings my cast rain through forever and ever it's power to you all remember cast brings change not peace